Hi, so I'm making this video to show you how to list products on Walmart, uh, how to add items on Walmart. So you need to click on add items over here. Uh, so you can add the item um, via the interface of Walmart or you could add items in bulk, which takes you to a spreadsheet. So I'm going to show you both the ways. So to add items through uh, single items, uh, you would see the same interface that you see on Amazon as well. Um, if you want to uh, list products on someone else's listing you can just add in their uh, item id listing id their upc or anything and then you can add your product to that listing or if you want you can start your own listing from scratch and that is how we will go through on this video so you can click on add it here it takes you to this interface where you can add the product that you want and then you can put in the upc or any of the information uh, that you have uh, generally we have the upc you can add the upc over here it will and when you press enter it will actually see if someone else is someone else is using this upc as well so it's best to first start with the upc at the upc currently uh i don't have a upc i'm not actually listing a um, product i'm just showing you how we could do that fulfillment uh is either you could get fulfilled yourself so if you are doing it yourself then you need to go to seller profile or if walmart is fulfilling your item you need to click on walmart fulfillment listing again you can even change when you have the seller fulfill listing you can even convert it later on to a walmart fulfill listing as well so it's not an, an issue if you select something uh, at the start and you want to change it later on category you can select the category uh once you select the category it will then show you all the uh, required options over here that you need to add uh put in the item name that's this is an important stuff so if it's a sofa is add sofa uh length uh, width sorry uh, with color and then all of those important stuff you can add over here you can add the sku it's really important to add the sku one time because it's really hard to then change it later on side description you can add the product description you can add your product uh, brand brand name i'm only going to talk about the ones that are really important that you need to uh, add uh, Otherwise, you can't list the product. So it's basically denoted with the star over here with a red star. Uh, then you can also add the key features. It's not an important thing, but just add one or two features. Um, and then uh, you need to go down. There isn't any more required options. So then you need to go. Yeah, that's pretty much th those are all the attributes, listing attributes that you can add later on as well. Uh, you can add the image uh, add the main image uh, and then uh, you can all later on add other images as well you need to add the offer so this is really important without which you cannot separate you need to add the selling price the shipping weight uh, and just put in the site started to it from today uh, and then that's pretty much it uh, you would have the image you have the offer you have the item contents and that is pretty much it this will then you can then go over here and submit changes and it would then allow you to uh, move forward and have your listings live if you want to add items in bulk uh, you can click again click on any fulfillment types download the uh, the flat file or the excel sheet this is how the excel sheet would look like you can need to add all the in uh, important stuff sku uh, product id uh, type uh, the upc and all of those stuff that we talked about only the important stuff these are all optional uh you can add all the optional stuff as well but these are all the important stuff once you have all the information on the excel sheet save it and then upload it over here and then it would then be uploaded and uh, you can make the listing live and that's how you would add products through a single item upload uh, from the interface or how you would add on a bulk if you want to add more items on a spreadsheet it, it allows you to uh, add all those stuff in the spreadsheet and then upload it so that's pretty much it. Thank you for watching. And uh, if you have any questions, you can reach out to me. Thank you very much.